Well, as we think about the Puritan Thomas Goodwin, there's probably no better place to begin than to answer the question, who were the Puritans? And so although many devoted believers today love the robust theology and rich writings that were produced by the Puritans, in reality, the name Puritan was not a compliment. It actually originated as a derogatory term. Uh, it was intended to be an insult aimed at particular Christians who were seeking to live lives of exceptional purity and devotion. So to be a Puritan then meant that you had a deep love for God's Word, you devoted yourself to seriously applying God's truth, and you sought to purify every aspect of your worship for the one true and living God. And so although there is no exact era or specific time period for Puritanism, we can think of the Puritans as the flowering blossoms that were produced by the seeds of the Reformation. So following in the footsteps of reformers like Luther and Calvin, the Puritan era is most predominantly identified with those Reformed Christians who lived in England during the 16th and 17th centuries. And yet, as we know, their influence is immeasurable, stretching on even to our present day, not the least of which being the influence of Thomas Goodwin. 